Hey guys, you're watching Vida Lada TV. Lyman's number two alloy is a great all round alloy for cast bullets. And today I want to show you how to make a similar one. And the Brunel hardness of Lyman's number two is 15. It contained 19% lead, 5% tin, and 5% antimonium. Okay, let's start blending. Here you can see my equipment, very important, face and uh, hand protection. And in bucket number one you can see 20 pounds of pure lead. In bucket number two there are 20 pounds of linotype, those little pieces here. I start melting the linotype because these are little pieces and they melt very fast. Try to cast outdoor and if you have to cast indoor like I have to do now, uh, make sure it's a well ventilated area. It took maybe 5 or 10 minutes to melt down the linotype and now I add small pieces of my pure lead. To make sure the tin and antimonium is well mixed in the alloy and to clean the lead, I flux it with paraffin wax. I repeat this process maybe four or five times to remove most of the dirt in the lead. Last but not least I fill my muffin mold with a lead alloy. Okay, and here you can see the result. These are 25 muffins and a little bit more of an equivalent of Lyman's number 2 alloy. The Brunel hardness of this alloy is 15. I want to cast some bullets for a 357 SIG. I received the barrel, a lone wolf barrel for my Glock next week, hopefully. And I want to cast some bullets with 125 grain. And this should be enough for maybe 2200 of them. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this little video here. Don't forget to vote, subscribe and to leave a comment. Thank you very much for taking the time watching my video.